Hey there, ever caught yourself in a nostalgic whirlwind, wandering down the memory lane of old Hollywood? If you've ever stumbled upon the timeless charm of a leaner Parker, chances are you're in for a trip down memory lane. From the first flicker of recognition to the warmth of cherished recollections, Parker's presence on the screen tends to linger in the mind. Now, let's swap stories, shall we? Think back to the moment when Alina Parker first etched herself into your cinematic consciousness. Maybe it was the way she seamlessly brought characters to life, leaving an indelible mark on your movie-watching experience. Perhaps it was a particular scene that resonated, a line that lingered, or just the undeniable aura she brought to every frame. Random facts, you say. Alina Parker, born in 1922, was more than a Hollywood star. She was a three-time Oscar nominee with a career spanning five decades. Her versatility was a force to be reckoned with ranging from the gritty realism of detective story to the enchanting world of the sound of music. Parker's ability to effortlessly navigate diverse roles made her a true cinematic icon. But here's the kicker, did you know she almost became a lawyer? Yes, Parker had plans for a legal career, but fate had a script of its own, and we're grateful for it. So, buckle up for a ride through the captivating life of Alina Parker, where the real meets the real, and every fact is a frame in her cinematic journey. Get ready to discover the woman behind the roles, the actress who made an indelible mark on the silver screen. And remember, it's not just about the movies, it's about the memories they carve. Here's to Alina Parker, an actress who transcends time leaving us with a legacy that flickers long after the credits roll. Alina Parker, a luminous star of the silver screen, graced Hollywood with her talent and elegance for over five decades. Born on June 26, 1922, in Cedarville, Ohio, she emerged as one of the most versatile and captivating actresses of her time. Parker's journey to stardom was anything but conventional. In the early 1940s, she caught the eye of a talent scout while vacationing in California. Despite initial reluctance, Parker's foray into acting marked the beginning of a remarkable career. Often hailed as the woman of a thousand faces, she demonstrated an unparalleled ability to adapt to a diverse range of roles. Her breakout performance came in 1950 with the film Caged, where she portrayed a young woman imprisoned for a crime she didn't commit, earning an Academy Award nomination for Best Actress. While Parker's talent shone brightly on screen, her personal life was marked by resilience and determination. In 1966, she survived a near-fatal accident when a truck struck her car, resulting in extensive injuries. Undeterred, she battled through a challenging recovery and returned to acting with the same passion and commitment that defined her earlier years. One of Parker's lesser-known achievements lies in her venture into television, where she excelled with the same grace that defined her film career. In the 1970s, she earned critical acclaim for her role as the Baroness in the television adaptation of The Sound of Music, showcasing her versatility in both film and the burgeoning medium of television. Despite her undeniable talent, Parker faced the inevitable ebbs and flows of fame. Her career witnessed peaks and troughs, yet she persevered, leaving an indelible mark on the industry. In 1981, she received a well-deserved star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame a testament to her enduring impact on the world of entertainment. Alina Parker's legacy extends beyond the celluloid. Her philanthropic endeavors, particularly her involvement with charities supporting cancer research, showcased a compassionate side that endeared her to many. Off-screen, she was not just an actress, but a woman of substance, navigating the complexities of fame with dignity and authenticity. As the final credits rolled on her illustrious career, Alina Parker left an enduring legacy, not just as an actress, but as a symbol of resilience, talent, and grace. Her ability to captivate audiences and overcome personal challenges cements her as a true Hollywood icon. Alina Parker, the accomplished actress known for her versatile roles, left a lasting mark on Hollywood. Upon her passing, she found her final resting place at Forest Lawn Memorial Park, Hollywood Hills, Lot 3799, Eternal Love. She lies beside her fourth and last husband, Raymond Hirsch. This tranquil location reflects the serenity she brought to her audiences on the silver screen. One of Parker's most memorable moments in cinema history was her role in Caged. To authentically portray a female convict, she underwent a striking transformation 
having her blonde hair buzzed off to the scalp. This bold move showcased her dedication to her craft and added a layer of realism to her performance. Beyond her on-screen achievements, Alina Parker shared genuine friendships with fellow actresses Andrea King, Lana Turner, and Jane Greer. These connections highlighted a camaraderie in the often competitive world of Hollywood, underscoring Parker's ability to build lasting relationships. In her career, Alina Parker demonstrated not only her acting prowess, but also her willingness to take on challenging roles. From her compelling on-screen presence to her personal connections within the industry, Parker's legacy endures. Her burial alongside her last love, Raymond Hirsch, at Eternal Love in Hollywood Hills, is a poignant reminder of her impact on the world of cinema. Alina Parker, acclaimed actress of the silver screen, made headlines when she exchanged vows with Paul Clemens at the renowned Hollywood Methodist Church on Thanksgiving Day in 1954. The ceremony marked a notable event in the actress' life, capturing the attention of the public and the media. Following her illustrious career in Hollywood, Parker transitioned to a quiet retirement in Palm Springs, California, where she lived from 2003 until her passing. This serene period allowed her to step away from the limelight and enjoy a more private existence. While many know Parker for her acting prowess, some might be surprised to learn that she played a role in a significant moment in transportation history. On March 19, 1949, she broke a champagne bottle on the nose of the locomotive, inaugurating the California Zephyr, a distinguished passenger train that embarked on its maiden journey from San Francisco to Chicago at the Western Pacific Depot. Alina Parker's life, marked by a Hollywood wedding, a quiet retirement, and a momentous train launch, reflects the multifaceted nature of her journey both on and off the screen. Her legacy endures in the annals of cinema and in the memories of those who appreciate the artistry she brought to the silver screen. Alina Parker, the renowned actress of her time, had a deep admiration for Carol Lombard, considering her a favorite actress. Lombard's charismatic performances left a lasting impression on Parker, inspiring her own acting journey. This admiration served as a guiding light in Parker's illustrious career, motivating her to excel in her craft. One remarkable aspect of Alina Parker's dedication to her career was her swift return to work after giving birth to her son Paul Clemens. Just 10 months after childbirth, she embarked on the filming of A Hole in the Head in 1959. This decision showcased her commitment to her profession and her ability to balance motherhood with her demanding work schedule. In recognition of her outstanding contributions to the world of cinema, Alina Parker received a special honor in June 2013. Turner Classic Movies celebrated her as their Star of the Month, a tribute that highlighted her remarkable talent and the enduring impact of her work on audiences. Alina Parker's career and her passion for acting made her an iconic figure in Hollywood, with her favorite actress, Carol Lombard, serving as an inspiration. Her dedication to her craft and her ability to balance work and motherhood, as seen in her swift return to work after childbirth, exemplify her commitment to the world of film. The honor bestowed upon her by TCM in June 2013 stands as a testament to her enduring legacy in the entertainment industry. As we bid adieu to this journey through the remarkable career of Alina Parker, it's time to pause and reflect. You've traveled through the tapestry of her performances, felt the emotions she conveyed, and witnessed her artistry unfold on the silver screen. But this isn't the end, it's an invitation to delve deeper into your own connection with this cinematic legend. Alina Parker's talent was a canvas on which she painted a myriad of characters, each with its own unique hues and shades. From her spellbinding portrayal of the indomitable Baroness in The Sound of Music to her hauntingly poignant role in Caged, she left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Her ability to breathe life into characters made her an icon, a true luminary of the silver screen. Now, it's your turn to shine the spotlight on your own memories and thoughts. Did a particular role resonate with you on a personal level? Was there a performance that moved you to tears or filled your heart with joy? Take a moment to reflect on how Alina Parker's work touched your life, and if you're inclined, share your thoughts with us. Your words can become a testament to the enduring impact of her craft. In the realm of entertainment, Alina Parker stands as a beacon of excellence, inspiring generations with her talent, dedication, and grace. She reminds us that art has the power to transcend time 
and connect us across the ages. We're grateful for the moments she shared with us, the characters she brought to life, and the emotions she stirred within our hearts. Thank you for joining us on this journey, for celebrating Alina Parker's remarkable legacy, and for sharing your own reflections. Your participation adds depth to our appreciation, and together we honor a true legend of the silver screen.